Here with head coach Melissa Graves following BU's 53-45 loss to Northeastern. Uh, coach, could you just offer up some thoughts about the game? Yeah, I think it's just kind of the same story for us. 23 turnovers, is, it really hurts us a lot. Um, so just trying to figure out that piece. Luckily now, you know, I talked to the team after. Luckily now we have at least a week before our next game so we could really, you know, hone in and work on that specifically. What do you attribute uh, those struggles with the most in regards to the turnovers? I mean, it hurts not to have Alex um, as the backup point guard to help out a little bit with that. Um, just getting frantic, I think it's just a lot of growing pains for us right now. You know, last year they had Katie Nelson at the point and she had the ball in her hand a lot. Um, trying to grow and just be able to play fast with an up-tempo. Um, today, I think it just really got us. We prepared. We knew they were going to pressure us. Um, but we just tried to push. We weren't getting a lot out of it. And instead of settling in the half court and making us uh, making them guard us, um, we just we unfortunately coughed it up 23 times. On a day where your post step was hindered a little bit, Riley Childs has another double-double, 13 points, mm -hmm. 10 boards. Uh, what about her game makes her effective, not only down low, but being able to shoot outside? You know, she's just a really versatile kid. Um, we worked a lot in the preseason with her on feeling more comfortable shooting the three, taking it off the bounce a little bit. Um, you know, so I think she just feels more comfortable within this offense specifically. But her ability to crash the glass is another huge thing. The energy she brings. I thought we were a little dead today. I know it was an earlier game. Um, you know, they still looked a little bit sleepy, but I thought Riley did a tremendous job just bringing energy and bringing spark into the game. So now you have eight days, as you mentioned, before your next game against Merrimack. Outside of the turnovers, any other adjustments or things that you're looking out for in practice? You know, we'd love to get Alex healthy. We'd love to get Caitlin healthy. You know, it really hurt us to miss her again, too, especially with Marin falling out. Um, we didn't have that big presence inside today, um, which I thought we could have really taken advantage of with um, Northeastern size. They were a little small in there. So would love to get everyone healthy, really work on um, just, I think the turnovers is the biggest piece if we could stop turning the ball over. Unfortunately, today we didn't shoot the ball <clears throat> like we have been, um, but hopefully get back to that. Hopefully it was just a day we were off um, on our shooting night, but I think the turnovers is the biggest piece.